going to do a different hello song today. We're going to start with a tick tock. So we need your finger. Tick tock, tick tock, the clock goes tick tock, the clock goes tick tock. It's time to say hello. Hello, babies. Hello, children. Hello, everyone. It's time to say hello. Tick tock, tick tock, the clock goes tick tock, the clock goes tick tock, the clock goes tick tock. It's time to say hello. Hello, babies. Hello, children. Hello, everyone. It's time to say hello. Hi, guys. Skin a marinky dinky dink, skin a marinky do. I love you. Skin a marinky dinky dink, skin a marinky do. I love you. I love you in the morning and in the afternoon. I love you in the evening and underneath the moon. Skin a marinky dinky dink, skin a marinky do. I love you. Ba -dum, ba -dum. I love you too. Boop boop be doo. Mwah. Let's take a trip to the moon. Ready, book book? Zoom, zoom, zoom. We're going to the moon. Zoom, zoom, zoom. We're going very soon. If you'd like to take a trip, climb on board a rocket ship and zoom, zoom, zoom. We're going to the moon. Ready? Five, four, three, two, one. Blast off! Again? Okay then. Zoom, 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 we're going to the moon. Zoom, 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 we're going very soon. If you'd like to take a trip, climb on board a rocket ship and zoom, 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 we're going to the moon. Five, four, three, Two, one, blast off! Yay! If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, and you really want to show it. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, stamp your feet. If you're happy and you know it, stamp your feet. If you're happy and you know it, and you really want to show it. If you're happy and you know it, stamp your feet. If you're happy and you know it, blow kiss kiss mwah mwah. If you're happy and you know it, blow kiss kiss mwah mwah. If you're happy and you know it, and you really want to show it. If you're happy and you know it, blow kiss kiss. If you're happy and you know it, shout we are. We are. If you're happy and you know it, shout we are. We are. If you're happy and you know it, and you really want to show it. If you're happy and you know it, shout we are. We, we are. are. Eyes, nose, cheeky, cheeky, chin. Cheeky, cheeky, chin, nose, eyes. Eyes, nose, cheeky, cheeky chin, cheeky, cheeky chin, nose, eyes, and again. Eyes, nose, cheeky, cheeky chin, cheeky, cheeky chin, nose, eyes. Eyes.
Chinny's nose, cheeky cheeky chin, cheeky cheeky chin nose eyes. Good job. Today's story is called Lost and Found. And this one is written and illustrated by Oliver Jeffers. It's one of my favorites. And it's published by HarperCollins Children's Books. Lost and Found. Once there was a boy and one day he found a penguin at his door. The boy didn't know where it had come from, but it began to follow him everywhere. The penguin looked sad and the boy thought, hmm, it must be lost. So the boy decided to help the penguin find its way home. He checked in the lost and found office, but no one was missing a penguin. He asked some birds if they knew where the penguin came from, but they ignored him. Some birds are like that. The boy asked his duck, but the duck floated away. He didn't know. That night, the boy couldn't sleep for disappointment. He wanted to help the penguin, but he didn't know how. The next morning, he discovered that penguins come from the South Pole. But how could he get there? He ran down to the harbor and asked a big ship to take them to the South Pole. But his voice was much too small to be heard over the ship's horn. So together, he and the penguin would row to the South Pole. The boy took his rowboat out of the cupboard and they tested it for size and strength. They packed everything they would need and together they pushed the rowboat out to sea. They rowed south for many days and nights with the boys telling stories all the way. The penguin listened to everything that the boys said. They floated through good weather and bad. When the waves were as big as mountains, until they came to the South Pole. The boy was delighted, but the penguin said nothing. Suddenly, it looked sad again as the boy helped it out of the boat. And the sign says, welcome to the South Pole. The boy said goodbye and floated away but as he looked back, the penguin looked sadder than ever. Oh, poor penguin. It felt strange to be on his own. And the more he thought, the more he realized he was making a big mistake. The penguin wasn't lost. He was just lonely. Quickly, he turned the boat around and headed back to the South Pole as fast as he could. At last, he reached the pole again. But where was the penguin? The boy searched and searched, but he was nowhere to be found. Look what's happening over here. Here's a little boy. And who's that over there, I wonder? Hmm. Sadly, the boy set off for home. There was no point telling stories because there was no one to listen except the wind and the waves. But then the boy saw something in the water ahead of him. Closer and closer he got until he could see. What do we think it is? 
the penguin. Oh, and look at them hugging at the very end. And so the boy and his friend went home together, talking of wonderful things all the way. See you next time. Thanks for joining us today. But now it's time to say goodbye. Are you ready, bug? We we'll say goodbye to everybody. Let me see these hands and we'll wave goodbye. Goodbye everyone, goodbye everyone, glad that you could come. Goodbye everyone, goodbye everyone, glad that you could come. Ay, 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 I'm glad that you could come. Ay, 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 I'm glad that you could come. Bye.